We've got 800 people who are regularly sleeping out in the cold. Calgary's vulnerable population is struggling to survive in this cold weather. While some are forced to sleep on the streets, others are trying to access help at homeless shelters. According to the last count, there's 2,800 people who are experiencing homelessness in Calgary. You know, 70% of those have shelter of some sort, but about 30% of those people sleep on the street. So when it's minus 20 or minus 30 with the windshield, that's extremely dangerous. That's when risk of amputations or death becomes very serious. Um, and we know that 30% of people experiencing homelessness say it's because they simply can't afford housing. Clinton Seibert, street level supervisor with the Mustard Seed says, in the current cold snap in Calgary, the vulnerable on the streets seek more help than ever because some of them are still hesitant to access shelter homes, possibly due to a few reasons, including rules and regulations in place there. They just don't feel safe in various shelters, or maybe they had a, a negative experience within the shelters as well. Um, and that can include, you know, violence, theft of, of property. We see that a lot. People get, um, have items that are stolen from them. Uh, or, or maybe someone just has like various accommodations as well. They might have a friend who is able to get a hotel room or a friend who's willing to let them sleep on the couch. Campbell says Calgary needs affordable housing more than ever now not only to provide permanent shelter to the vulnerable, but also to help the city transform into a safe community. It's super important that not only do we have, uh, you know, the support of all the levels of government, but also that people say yes when it comes to developing more affordable housing, because, you know, the things that Calgarians are concerned about when it comes to visible homelessness and safety downtown, you know, and safety on Calgary streets, uh, everyone is better off when they uh, are provided with a home and communities are better off when people are housed. In Calgary, Hannah Said, City News.